number of new movies opening this weekend. It sure is, and thank you both. Heartbreakers, written, directed, and produced by the very talented Bobby Roth, asks the question that some of the more macho men of the world, if I may be permitted that judgment for a moment, might not particularly care for. That is, why do men have such a hard time showing emotions and getting past that superficial macho image? Heartbreakers answers that question through the longtime close friendship of two men, one successful businessman and Nick Mancuso, and one yet to be recognized, not so successful artist in Peter Coyote. Now, their need for happiness is one thing they have in common, and something else they have in common is the same taste in women. Open with you two. in and around our very own stomping grounds here in Los Angeles, you'll recognize one of our more famed eateries near the intersection of La Cienega and San Vicente. That's right, Fat Burger. Have you tried their burgers? They're great. And fitness freaks will also recognize that friendly temple of sweat and fitness known as the Sports Connection on Santa Monica Boulevard. Even though it bears another name in the movie, we know it's safe. How about a cup of coffee across the street? No. Yeah. How about a drink? Will you have dinner with me? Yeah. Sometime? Uh -uh. She's crazy about it. It's a sensitive, well-told story filled with those very private moments we all experience at one time or another, and a tad heavy on the editing, I thought. Some scenes ran far too long after the point had been made, and one scene in particular bothered me where both men are vying for the same woman, and you have Pat Benatar singing Love is a Battlefield in the background. That was just a little bit obvious, but other than that, a terrific movie made in 30 days. Oh, well, that was, again, one of those small movies, and I'm so fearful of them getting lost mm -hmm. when all these big ones are opening. Good. Thank you, Chantal.